Hey everyone and welcome to a new video. Today I want to roughly show you our process of setting up virtual AI characters you can talk and interact with inside of Unreal Engine. But before we dive in, I will also show you different use cases for games but also for other cool business use cases. In my last videos, you already saw many different use cases for those characters. I showcased in-game characters in the Matrix City you can talk and interact with, which would be super cool for games like GTA to make the experience even more immersive. But I also showed you virtual AI store clerks selling and explaining complex both physical and digital products or give you a roadshow through the office explaining your services or also an AI which act as a testimonial to build up trust and shorten your sales cycles. And since you now roughly know how those virtual AI characters can look like, I want to talk now about how we actually set up those characters or which technologies we are using. As a foundation, we use, of course, Unreal Engine Meta Humans. Those virtual characters using 8K textures and are by far the most realistic characters which can be used in games right now and those realistic characters make applications even more immersive and especially for business use cases the graphics matter because you want to attract affluent adults and not children playing Fortnite or whatever. But how do we manage it to actually talk to those characters? There are right now different service providers on the market and everyone have their own pros and cons. If you are currently looking forward to build those characters in your game or other applications, then feel free to contact me so I can analyze your use case and help you find the best solution for that. But here you already have a little overview. Replica, for example, has a very powerful voice generation AI, which can even express feelings and emotions, but there are also the generation times are a bit longer. You saw it in action in my videos of the Unreal Engine Matrix City, but th there also I cut it out all the loading times to make the videos more entertaining and more engaging that you don't need to wait, I don't know, sometimes half a minute or something like that until a, until the answer is generated, basically. Their plugins are accessible over their website or also the Unreal Engine Marketplace, so feel free to check them out and integrate them to your game. And if you want an exact tutorial for the setup of any of those tools then let me know it in the comments and I can also make videos about that in the future. Another very powerful tool is Conv AI. The response times here are much faster and it also can detect what you say and perform actions according to that and demos for that are for example our virtual offices where the AI also moves through the level and explain everything. But also with Conf AI you have the feature to set up a complex knowledge base and background story which can be used to insert all of your products but also for complex in-game characters with a deep background story. So you already see this can be a more complex topic since there are many different service providers out there and I just in this video only mentioned two but there are many many more out there and even we are currently working on our own AI solutions but those are still in the development currently but I can't wait to also show and present you those. And always when I talk about this topic and all that stuff I am very fascinated about all the different use cases in game like you can use them as a virtual character and which enhance the gameplay experience by providing dynamic interactions and storylines. You could set up companions uh, which can yeah, um, accompany players on their journey offering assistance, commentary and emotional engagement or showing you how the game actually work. Or you can also set up enemy AI which will more realistic and challenge players making the gaming experience even more immersive and exciting. And also like character customization plays a big role here because players can create and customize yeah, virtual characters to represent themselves in the game world but also promoting personalization and identity for those AI companions. So they really, so you really feel connected with your companion since you can then also like customize it. Also those virtual characters play essential roles in narrative driven games influencing the story 
storyline and also player choices. But uh, there are also many use cases for businesses. Uh, we already talked about the virtual offices where you have a virtual character who can like populate in the virtual office spaces and enhancing remote work experiences by facilitating meetings, interactions, or also training. And especially like for training simulations, this also can be cool because those virtual characters are used for for example, also employer training simulations, helping trainees to learn and practice skills in a safe, controlled environment, basically. But also for customer service, those can get used because the AI driven virtual characters serve as a like virtual customer service agents assisting customers with their inquiries and tasks, basically. But also branding and marketing can get enhanced with those virtual brand ambassadors um, or mascots promoting products and also services through engaging interactions with the customers in their own virtual office, for example, um, which can also get used basically to build up a community around the brand, basically, which will like stick to you because you stay in their minds in the long term, basically, which will generate like more returning customers. But also virtual events and conferences can get set up with those virtual characters because we can host and guide attendees through virtual events and conferences by adding human touch to the digital experience. These use cases demonstrate the versatility and potential impact of realistic virtual characters in both gaming and also various business applications. And as we wrap up today's exploration of creating realistic AI characters inside of Unreal Engine 5 and their incredible potential in both gaming and business, I hope you are as excited about the future as I am because the world of virtual characters is evolving rapidly and the possibilities are basically endless. And yeah, if you are currently working on any AI projects in Unreal Engine or have plans to dive into this exciting field, remember that you don't have to go this way alone, basically. We are here to support you with every step of your way, basically. Our team specializes in finding the best AI tools and also plugins for your specific needs, whether you are looking to integrate MetaHumans, ConfAI, or other cutting edge technologies inside of your Unreal Engine game. We have got you covered, basically. And that's not all. We also developed custom AI frameworks that can accelerate your project's development. And these frameworks are designed to save you time and also resources, helping you achieve your goals faster. So don't hesitate to reach out whether you have questions, need guidance, or want to explore potential collaboration opportunities. We are just a message away and together we can bring your AI projects to life and make them truly exceptional. But yeah, that's it for this video. Thank you very much for joining us today and remember to like, subscribe and also hit the notification bell to stay updated with the latest developments in AI and Unreal Engine. And your support means the world to us and we look forward hearing from you soon. So have a wonderful rest of your day and take care. Bye.